welcome back to this Minecraft Let's Play. Today, it's been almost a week since I've recorded. I just recorded a bunch of videos, which ended on 40. And now 40 is up, I can really say this without much worry. As you all saw, Wilson has been killed. I believe that is the grave that was set up for him. Uh, first thing I would like to do is I'd like to just apologize for episode 40. I really like, I don't know. I, I kind of want a little mental there. Um, oh sweet, I think guess that's a pumpkin. Um, so yeah, I have started thinking about what the heck I should do. I mean, we had Wilson, he was really cool, he stayed here. I've, now in hindsight, I should have left him there until everything cooled down. I mean, hindsight's twenty twenty. Now I'm going to investigate this, I saw this, it's, alright, as I predicted, Wilson's grave, um... I can't remember which one of my friends built this, you say it was. And if I am right inside are the um snowballs that you know the one snowball that was found. So I am gonna leave it here for now. Um So I've thought about what I should do. The base I mean, we ended one of the episodes, almost it was like thirty four or something. I needed to clean up uh this this mess that uh Celtic has made. So, the plan now has been really just, um, I mean, I guess clean it up, maybe? Get out of, like, war mode and into more just relaxed mode. I mean, I still have plans. I, there's still a lot of stuff I need to get done. One of the big things that just I need to get done, like, really soon is I would like just to build a prison for bomb effect. And... As for his friend, he'll stay in there too, because people have been like telling me like they're gonna do this, they're gonna do that, and so. All right, do I have a uh, iron pickaxe or something? I have a few stone pickaxes. So, in this episode, I begin. I at least I plan on beginning the uh, just a seal process, like where I'm pretty much just gonna go somewhere out here. I mean, I've considered really just putting it in the mountain over there, but I wanted to build some stables there. Actually, I think we do have one war prisoner who survived. I could be wrong, though. I'm afraid I don't know if he was. So my horse, so far, is the only animal who has not been killed from this war. Um, I know part of the reason Bomb Effect said he had to get rid of, uh, I mean, I'll just say that, get rid of Wilson, was due to the fact that he, um, what was it? That I killed his dog. I mean, you guys kind of have video proof. I didn't even, I don't even think I saw his dog. I saw his first dog for a second in episode 15, his first dog. And I want to say in episode 17 or maybe 18, I saw his second dog. But, like, I never touched the dog. I mean, I hit, I want to say I hit him once, but, yeah. But, pretty much in this episode, all I plan on doing is just taking down some of the war stuff. Um, surveying the the damage and destruction this just entire wars caused, I and mean, fixing that that kind of stuff really annoys me. I mean, that's really what I gotta do. I mean, it's uh March thirty no twenty ninth. So, I mean, I do have a lot of stuff coming up. Tuesday, I'm going out for dinner for my sister's birthday. Um, today we spent a lot of day we spent all of today celebrating. I seriously have not had a um, uh, much of a minute's rest, really, this entire weekend. I don't think I've been at my house for more than, like, three hours at a time. Because I got home on Friday. I'm just going you know, to commentate, you know. But I got home on Friday, talked to a person, a girl, who I th kind of like, and, yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to get into my personal life here. Um, so, after that, though... At 6 o'clock, I left. I went to a school nearby. I won't name the school just for personal and safety reasons that my mom's always yelling about. And, you know, just in case she watches the video. Yeah. Um, so we went to a school and I practiced from 6 to 9 for a huge, uh, it's called All City Band that I'm performing in. And so for three hours, we sat there and practiced. Um, then got home, played for 
played on my PC for about three hours, and then my sister had a few friends over, so I didn't really get to stay awake mu very long, just because, you know, they were downstairs playing Monopoly, yelling, so I couldn't record without you all hearing just yelling in the background. I'm like, yeah, I don't want to do that. Just something I don't really want to do. So, what I went on from there, I just pretty much went to sleep at like midnight, looked me a little after, passed out, you know, it's kind of go to sleep means, um, and from there, I basically woke up at about 7.30, uh, instead of taking a shower, just ran over to a, um, uh, what was it, um, like one of the, uh, I guess you could say, uh, can't remember the name, it's just angry. Um, to one of the, like, um, I don't want to say, like, bathrooms, because it's not a bathroom. Like, do you know the, um, like, it's just a mirror or something? Like, it's just a mirror and a sink? Like, what would you call that? There's no, there's no, like, shower in there, anything like that? Whatever. Bottom line, I'm just going to call it, like, a ready station. I don't know. I know there's an actual term that, like, everyone uses, and I just all of a sudden can't remember it. Um, I pretty much got my hair, got everything ready, and then, uh, as a prank, because I was told to do this at, like, 9 o'clock from uh, one of my friends who dropped me off, basically to blow a trumpet in her sister's face, because the girl who dropped me off, no, that's not the one I like, um, the girl who dropped me off, her sister was playing it at my house because just, you know, my sister's birthday, a little celebration, someone to come over. So we did that, uh, so I took out my instrument, blasted a note in her face while they were all asleep. Sad face, not much of a reaction, and therefore I don't think I'll upload it. Um, I don't even know if I should do that. Uh, so then after that, what I did is from, I would like to say, 8.30 to 1.30, I practiced like in a group or this is all in a group practicing um I yeah, pretty much just practiced for the uh, band thing and then after that I am um, uh got I will admit I did get a little rest from there um alright was it or when was it um was that last no, that was last week that wasn't this week um so from there I basically I'm like trying to remember what I'm saying Oh crap, guys, I didn't go on busy. Very sorry. I'm like, just, I'm out of it. I haven't recorded in like a week. I'm like, what's going on? You know, I'm just getting back into the swing of things. Um, but, yeah, from 8.30 to 1.30, I practiced again with that group. Um, and finally from there, got, I did stay home for about four hours or so. Got to relax, but spent most of that time just thinking about the concert. And so it came around, and just like that, um, I went and performed at a stadium. Not exactly a stadium, more of like just, it's not, it's a uh, theater, I should say. I don't know, bottom line, it's called the, I mean, if I say this, I'm going to give away what city I live in, so I won't say the name. But it was a big theater, like three stories high, and I'm like, you know, I'm kind of shocked. I'm only, I'll, admit, I'll tell you my age, I'm only 13. And here I am, I'm sitting with, with my little instrument, I'll tell you my instrument too. I would play a trumpet. Um, here I am, 13, holding a trumpet in my hand. Or, yeah, in my hands. And everyone's now expecting us to play this just humongous crowd. I mean, although I will admit, it can probably only hold like 200 to 500 people. So in that range. I don't know, the kid next to me said it could hold like a 200 and that's it. I mean, considering there are three levels where the audience could sit, I feel like there was more than that, but I could be wrong. Alright. Oh, wait. What did I get? Gold helmet. Oh, there we go. I'll let you two fight. You're really not going to do jack squat. Oh, I need to hurt you, don't I? And there's, like, some little glitch so you can, like, kill the other in, like, one shot. I mean, it's really just let them sit there. Um... So let me try to remember where I was. But yeah. So here I am sitting there. About to play in front of this just huge audience. It's crazy. We go out there. And I'm impressed with myself. Because one of the highest notes 
or at least for me now, uh, that I can play was like, uh, I want to say it's high D for trumpet. Um, but it's just the first valve. It's very high pitched for me. I like that. I can't play high notes. Like, with just music and stuff, I never really was taught much. Like, anything I just wanted to learn, I had to teach myself. Or, like, just get advice from someone. So, one of the dumbest things I still have not been, like, officially taught is, <laughs> this is just not very stupid for me being in my second year, tonguing. No one's ever taught me that. No one ever said, this is what you do. No one ever taught me just anything about it, so... God, there's nothing inappropriate right on that one. Bomb effect. Um, I know bomb effect's plan though is like something like repair. He's based or something. Bomb line, I'm putting him in prison. His buddy is probably gonna go to prison. They're not coming. Yeah, they're not coming back. I did. I will admit this. Um, okay. I know a lot of you are gonna like really. That's kind of stupid. But I. I heard a zombie or a creeper then. Um, I put a ban on Bomb Effect. I told him he couldn't come into any more videos for a few days. Now, most of you are probably thinking that's because Wilson. Believe it or not, it's not. It is not because of Wilson. Um, if you noticed in episode 40, he made like a slightly religious comment. I mean, it's just, I mean, I didn't want, I mean, there's nothing wrong with you stating your religion or anything. And I have nothing against it. And... I, I do have my own religion myself, but I just don't want all that in my channel. It's to me that's just something that belong that its home is not on YouTube. That's just my opinion. I'm sorry. Just the same way uh T V shows don't belong on YouTube. T V shows belong on T V, YouTube videos and f just cat stuff and yeah. And big time YouTubers and gaming videos. That belongs on Minecraft. That's the kind of stuff that belongs on Minecraft. Not my <laughs> YouTube. Um, I also noticed. All right, spring break is coming up. I'm gonna try and move to some happier topics. Get my voice going here. Give me really happy. I'm gonna record a few videos. And there's a light over there that I want to investigate now. Um, spring break is coming up. I'm really happy about that. Spring break is gonna give me a while to relax because last weekend I was busy. This weekend I'll go over what I did today on Sunday in just a few minutes, but. Bottom line, I've been very busy. So, the fact that I've been able to... The fact that I just kept recording until Wilson got killed, I'm very happy with myself. But, yeah. I'll probably bring a Celtic or someone into this next video. Um, so, yeah. Well, basically, um... I, I don't know what I was saying, but I'll go into Sunday. So, pretty much what happened today is... It's not exactly an aquarium... But bottom line, one of the, uh, houses, I guess you could say, no, aquariums, um, just museums, there, I'll say that, um, one of the museums near my, uh, well, where I live, has this really cool, like, amusement park, it's not, it's not your tip, oh my gosh, it's not your typical roller coaster, it's, um, more of, it's like, uh, obstacle course, you have to pretty much climb all around, and just try to, I don't, I don't want to say survive, just get from obstacle to obstacle without, like, hurting yourself. And so, like, there's purple, yellow, and a few other colors. Um, it's purple, yellow, green, blue, black diamond, and double black diamond. Um, so pretty much I spent today doing that for my sister's birthday, which we went for two hours, um... And it was fun, yeah. Uh, my sister got me to, even though she's younger than me. Shut up, I'm afraid of heights. Um, even though she's younger than me, she did go on the green one and eventually convinced me to go on one of them. One reason was just I don't want to, you know, have to deal with my sister saying, "I want a green, I want a green one." You didn't, haha. Uh -huh. So I'm like, I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. Oh my gosh, I thought I could beat you. Hey, surprise disadvantage. Oh, he just got screwed over. Okay, so um, next thing, so that's what I've spent today doing. I woke up uh, you know, really tired, and pretty much I spent my morning, like, two hours I just sat down, played on my computer um, next two hours well, not really hours, but the next like, half an hour I spent 
I would like to say, eating breakfast, we had pancakes and bacon, and it was surprisingly good, like, better than usual. Um, <laughs> thanks to the mom, yeah. Uh, next thing that happened after that is I had to, um, I went on my computer, played for like another 30 minutes, and, uh, just a big fight with mom, that's just something that happens, you're a kid, and you're a teenager, you're even an adult sometimes, even sometimes seniors yell at their parents. Um, so, pretty much what happened was, I was just annoyed with all the stuff she was saying, I was really annoyed, oh my gosh, I fell. Um, and I didn't take damage, whoop de doo Uh, so, pretty much from there, not sure what this is, um, pretty much from there, we went to Adventure Park, yeah, that's the name of it, didn't mean to say that, whatever. Um, there's seven of them, so, good luck. Um, so pretty much from there, we went on all these zip lines and all this fun stuff, and I got a bunch of video of it, but the videos are only a few seconds long, so like 25 seconds each and uh, the green one which is the one my sister can just go on is like 25 feet up and remember the only thing holding you in is that harness so you slip don't you're just gonna be sitting there dangling so kinda hurts kinda doesn't it's I mean, it's just if you can take that initial step like there's zip lines there and I went on a few zip lines like if you can just take that first step on a zip line you're fine but getting down is very interesting cuz you can't just stop in the middle of this course and say I'm getting off. You can't. It there's no way for you to do that. Well, actually, I think they have a ladder you can use, but like it's not built in. You have to like call for someone and then you have to wait. And, like it's just not worth it. Like once you once you're on, you're on. You're not getting off easily. Um, so pretty much what happens from and I'm pretty sure you can only do that in the middle. No, at the end of the course. Like once you're on, you have to complete the course, with the exception of like if you haven't started yet. But, anyway, what you pretty much will do from there is just get yourself going. I plan on building, like, there. I built beyond that, so, yay. Um, so, yeah, they have all kinds of, like, little contraptions for you to use. I thought I would die there. Um, and so, one of them is, like, there's just this wooden dolphin you have to sit on and you go across. It sounds very easy. It is not. That dolphin is evil, I swear. War against dolphins. Um, yeah, you pretty much have to sit on it. You, it's, this is like the highest point of the entire thing. So this is like 25 feet in the air. After this, there's like a, a wooden, a sideways wooden bridge or something. Not bridge, ladder. So like, but the, each, uh, I should, like, there's the side bits, and then there's the, um, what is the other one? The, the, the can't remember all of a sudden. Like, I mean, I'm just, there's the sides, and I'm guessing, I would like to call them like this. The, uh, Stokes or something, like on a bike. And that's not it. Um, I got full. Just, I'll see, I guess, I don't know. Um, but basically, after that, what I did is, i to remember, I got someone to help me, like, someone who else was, who, someone else who was on the a course to help me and so pretty much from there I got across like not to help you get across cuz like there's no substitute you can't say alright I wanna do that uh, that part that part and that part no once you're on you're on you're not getting off easily uh... what I, what I put nah I'm gonna put this in warfare I understand it's a golden helmet that and boots that drop from a zombie but I mean they're not exactly like like if they were enchanted I'd put them in a uh, rare but they're not exactly rare. So, mm. oh yeah, and then that. So, I mean, that's pretty much why I've just been doing everything. Like, the uh, place I went to, the like, it was insane. Because when um, the the trumpet who's sitting next to me, I made a fifth chair out of, like, so in the entire city, in my entire city, uh, in all of 7th grade, which is probably, I'd say, 10,000 students, Actually, yeah, there's somewhere around there, and then out of um, like I've been realizing how much smaller the group is than what I've been saying it is. Um, once you realize, oh yeah, mm, this is only for seventh graders. Oh yeah, it's only for trumpets. When you get down to just the basic minimum, 
the, there ends up being like 500 trumpets in the city, and out of those 500, how many of them are actually going to try out? So in the end of the day, out of about 50 trumpets who went to the audition, and the 20 that were accepted, I made a fifth chair. So I'm. I don't know what you. T I don't know what you would call that. Um. So we're appearing to be coming up on the end of the video. I'm sorry we didn't really do anything exciting. I mean, I'm just working on just fixing everything outside the base. Um, my and uh, I did receive words about something that the uh, bomb effect is doing right now. It's just me in the world, and then the next video is also m gonna be just me. Maybe Celtic will come in. I just wanted to tell you all where I've been the past few days. Just if I haven't been like responding to comments so fast. Um. I know one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take down this little thing up here. I don't know what's got started up there. Like, I have not had time to just run this place. Like, as this happens, um, I don't even know what's going on here. What's his name? Like, I can't even remember. It just said, like, protect the farm and this and that. I'm like, what? Yeah, my, pretty much my main goal is just kill, uh, what's his face. And so, yep. Yay. Alright, so we'll harvest this. I think this is actually the first full harvest. So, cleaning up from war in the first full harvest. Nah, just cleaning up from war. Um, so I'm gonna replant these. Get Celtic in a party. And, um, yeah. So let me replant these. And I think that's gonna do it for this episode. So, thank you all for watching. Once again, I apologize for this just not being, like, the most energetic video. I'm still just calming down and from this busy weekend. I mean, I should be pretty free after this. I don't... Spring break's coming up. There's not much else for me to do. Um, for, I mean, I don't. I'm not going anywhere for spring break. Everyone else is. I'm not. I mean, over the summer I'm going to Niagara Falls, yay. But I'm not actually going anywhere exciting for spring break. That's just something I don't usually do. But I actually might be though. I know I'm might be traveling a very very long distance to go. Let's just say I'm going somewhere, because I don't really want to give that away either. Especially if that place ends up becoming really popular because of this. I like the place, I want to keep it kind of a secluded place. And it's really far away, it's a few hundred miles. Or is it? I don't know. Alright, um, but yeah. Just one more time, thank you all for watching, and well, I hope to see you all in the next episode. So, till then, uh, yeah. See ya. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through.